public. You got Matt Schlapp, uh, who runs that thing called CPAC. This is the FBI move shows that we become a third world country. Uh, Bernie Carrick told Newsmax the Dem Democrats are trying to assassinate Trump. I mean, right. th this really is a big lie 2.0. And it is I it strikes me as arguably more incendiary and more dangerous in the in the moment like you really are striking the match right next yep. to uh, a, a, a house that's already been soaked in, in kerosene. Yeah, I think that's right, John. I mean, the, the, the terms they're using, the, the, that this was an assassination, this was a, a hit, this was a raid, all these things they're doing, they're trying to frame this out as something that's outside the bounds, that's not that has nothing to do with Trump's long, consistent pattern of illegality. You know, Merrick Garland is a guy who has never once in his life yelled, hold my beer. This was a careful warrant. It was issued by a judge. It was done with all the review. They knew this would have these political impacts, and it was done in a very careful scope and, and manner. And uh, of course, Trump is going to lie about it. Of course, his people are going to lie about it. This also is a real sign that all the, 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 the flirtation with Ron DeSantis and Ted Cruz and anybody else who thought they were going to run in 24 with Fox, they're all back on board now with Trump. They're all back in bed with him. And I think you're going to see that Trump's going to try to lever this experience into his next campaign. And he's going to try to lever this experience into disrupting the country as much as he can. As Alexi pointed out, the Schedule F idea of basically burning down the government, filling it with little clones of Steve Bannon, um, is a extraordinarily dangerous. But they're relying on rhetoric and communications and narratives right now that, that are encouraging a base of people who have already demonstrated that they can be motivated to violence without much effort.